But I, I never forget when we were at your house and Mikhail committed to us, verbally committed, and you started crying. Mm -hmm. And I was like, what's, I'm, I'm T, are you all right? You're right. She's, you said, I know, I know I did my job. Yeah. I know I can pass him on to you. And I feel like I can now move on and do something for myself. Yeah. And oh, coach, don't make me cry. <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm crying. I'm crying. Oh, Tell him. But you, I, it was, I, I always share that with people to say like, this is what these moms do. Yeah. And this is their whole, like you gave up your whole life for 18 years and it just came out of you like right there. And yeah. it hit our yeah. staff, you know, like this, this, this is what we do. Mm. Like, this is our true responsibility. These moms pass on their, their kids to us. So you're, you're right. Like we are, we are tough on them on the court, but off the court, we try to love them up. And every decision we make, we try to make like, this is T's son. Yeah. This would be, you, you know, my kids, I, I, I got to treat them the same way as if they were my kids. And a lot of that comes down to holding them accountable. Like, I know you, you joked that I'm tough, but there's a lot of times you were saying to me, like, Hey, he better do better academically. Oh, I, this, this he says I'm tough too. Enough. So <laughs> yeah, this isn't good enough. And we, we were in, we were in that together. You know, we were, we were doing it together that you had done this for 18 years, you know, passed up job opportunities, passed up social life, passed up everything to get him where he is. And then that was the moment Like I realized, okay, now this is on me with you because you were still in it, but that, that it's not just about him being a great player, but it's about him completing his growth as a man. You could, you could only take him so far and then he's got to move away from home. So who's he going to do that with? And that was, I, that always, I mean, a lot of parents at that time say, okay, we're passing them on to you, but you were like, we were in your house. You cooked for us. We had dinner. You were all happy. And all of a sudden, that when he said, I'm coming to Villanova, bam, you started crying. And I remember <laughs> down next to you, like, you all right? And that statement, like, I did my job. And, and now I'm passing on. It was so cool and so impactful to all of us. It's something I always remember.